Hey kids, it's Chris Saucedo with another Mac Tip of the Week. So for this week's Mac Tip, we're going to be talking about something called screen capturing. Now, everybody that has a PC knows how to do a screen capture. All you have to do is hit the print screen button. But, as we're about to find out, on iMacs and Mac laptops alike, there's no print screen button. So how can we get around this? Um, I'm going to show you three ways of doing screen capture. So let's get started. All right. So, to prove my point, here is the iMac keyboard. And as you can see, there is no print screen button. So, in order to do this on a Mac, and I have iTunes open to the Invader Zim page, all you have to do is hit Command Shift 3 and you'll hear a picture taking sound. So now if we look in the corner here, you'll see that I have a picture1.png. That is, in fact, the screen capture of the entire desktop. And I can click on that to open it if I want to, but for the time being, I'm not going to. All right, so here we go. Now we're back. A cooler way of actually doing a screen capture, at least I think it's kind of cool, is to hit Command-Shift-4. Command Shift 4, let's see if we can see this here. It brings up a crosshair. Zoom in a little bit. It brings up a crosshair. So now you can drag your cursor to whatever point of the screen you actually want to capture. So let's say I want to capture Zim here. All I do is I click and I drag. And now when I let go, you'll hear another picture taking sound. Now if we look in the corner here, we have picture2.png, and as you can see, even from the thumbnail, it's only Zim himself. All right, and so the final way of doing screen capturing, at least that I know of, is also pretty cool. You have to, and it's going to be hard for me to do this with one hand, uh, control, command, shift, three. That's control, command, shift, three. If you do that correctly, I heard a picture taking sound. All right, now if you open a word processor, it automatically saves that screen capture to the clipboard. So if I hit Command V, there we go. You have your complete desktop screen capture. So to recap, you have Command Shift 3 to take the entire desktop picture you have command shift 4 to actually open a crosshair so you can select what part of the screen you want to capture and then you have control command shift 3 which automatically saves your desktop screen capture to the clipboard so you can paste it into your favorite word processor alright so that's pretty much it Chris Saucedo over and out